The 350Z06 to 08 style headlight that want to run an LED bulb in the parking light. Uh, so by default, or by, you know, factory, <coughs> the parking light comes on when you turn your parking lights on. And I'll show you that because I've got the other side um, not, not done yet with this mod. So what I'm doing is I've got an LED bulb. It's got built-in resistors. They work fine only with the parking lights and the headlight turned off. So if I turn my headlights on or my parking lights and use the turn signal, it hyper flashes. Um, so the deal is, like I said, um, what, what we're gonna do is mod the bulb. And when I say mod, it's using some electrical tape. And you'll see here in just a second that I'm gonna use the tape to cover up two of the four prongs. So two of those four prongs um, is what the adapter, you know, you plug your bulb into reads to come on with the parking lights. Uh, so what the electrical tape does is just cover those up. So when you turn your lights on, it sees like there's no bulb there. Um, the other two work just fine with your turn signal. So you can also clip the the wire off, two of the four wires off if you want. Um, the electrical tape, once you've covered it up and seated it, you know, in the adapter, I mean, it's gonna be fine. So, um, here are, these are Oxido LEDs. If you look them up, you can find them. They have like, I think they have a website. They've got Instagram, Facebook, um, but I found them on eBay <clears throat> and I bought plenty of their bulbs before and they ran about 18 bucks for the um, well yeah these are the 3157s for the 06 to 08 style so what I'm gonna show you here in just a second I'm gonna pull the bulb back out and you can see what I'm doing here with the tape and when it's in the adapter you know it only really touches like the side so that's what you need to cover up so when you're looking at it, you know, um, opposite side for each wire is how I've done it. And what I thought I was gonna have to, have to do is, um, I've got some other 3157s that don't have the built-in resistors and these are actually switchbacks. And I thought I was gonna have to hook these up and then run these bulbs, but uh, you know, for these resistors, I was hoping I wasn't gonna have to go through all that. So um, I've done this tape trick to make the car think that it has no parking lights installed, but then, you know, the other two wires are for the turn signal. So yeah, again, just run the tape over. If you're looking at the bulb, it's gonna be the left side prong. So yeah, just make sure, uh, you know, once it gets seated in there, it's fine. Just get some electrical tape, left side prong. All right, so as you can see, bulb is back in, parking lights are on, that bulb is off. There's the other bulb that I haven't done the mod yet to. And it is on. So, there's the turn signal. And I'll show you passenger side. You can see it hyper flashing over there. Again, lights off, parking lights on. Headlights on, turn signal, parking light, lights off. So yeah, all you gotta do is make sure those prongs are covered up 
and then you know put it back in there and you're good to go you don't gotta worry about the hyper flash or light coming on um, you know when you turn on your headlights uh, hyper flash with the turn signal um, if you know of any other ways to have the light on you know with your lights and also not have hyper flash because these bulbs like I said have built-in resistors so there's something else going on with the the three wire setup that's causing it to do that but um, you know hopefully this help, helps out somebody uh, leave a like if it did and uh, I'll see you next time